An Elsa man says he's fed up with the smell of sewage. He tells us it's been around off and on for the last 20 years. So he called Five on Your Side for help. Channel 5 Sierra Pizarro answered that call. Sierra. Dino, when he can't use his own bathroom, he runs down the street to a restroom in the nearby store. The city blames wet wipes for the sewer issue. Take a look. James Lara has lived here for 23 years. I love yard work. It's not hard to tell. I like it here. I like it very much. Like only goes such a long way behind the trinkets and scenery. I know when it's coming already. A smelly disruption. My sewer line starts backing up. And uh, uh, I've had this problem for the past, going on 23 years already. And I've dealt with the city many times. They put a Band-Aid over it, then it comes back again. Raw sewage, Lara says, covers his floors at different times throughout the year. Let's go inside. Channel 5 right here. It's clogged, but you won't see a mess because they've already cleaned it up. If we go back outside, you'll find more evidence, a cloudy water line to the brim of the valve. It's backed up right there. There it is. Lara leaves both open, so some of the pressure is released. Yeah, trying to clear it out just in case. Uh, we use a shower or whatever so it can, you know, back up and come out this way. Now what? It's got to be fixed. We wanted to know what the city of Elsa is doing to address Lara's issue. City Director of Operations Rene Rodriguez tells me stuck drains are a notorious problem for the area. He says a crew stopped by Lara's neighborhood earlier today and took care of the blockage. Director Rodriguez added the main perpetrators are baby wipes. He warns not to flush them even when the package says they are flushable. Live in studio, I'm Sierra Pizarro for Channel 5 News at 6.